Plenty of companies are now looking to use small, unmanned aircraft to make light package deliveries on short, so-called last-mile flights, with several trial operations already underway in the US and other countries. But autonomous flight technology pioneer X-Wing is looking to take a leap forward that would see aircraft without pilots on board delivering much larger cargo loads on routes of up to 500 miles within two years. The California-based company has been flight testing its autoflight system in a converted Cessna 208B Grand Caravan aircraft since July 2020. The system consists of detect and avoid sensors that assess airborne and ground-based collision hazards. The equipment also includes navigation and flight control software to generate optimal flight plans. And it interfaces with air traffic controllers, as well as ensuring that all aircraft systems are running safely and that it can deal with any operational contingencies that might crop up during the flight. If X-Wing can secure approval from US authorities, the company hopes to begin commercial freight operations in 2022. Now, initially, its aircraft would be controlled by an operator on the ground, mainly to handle interactions with air traffic controllers until a process for fully autonomous flight is well established. X-Wing founder Mark Piet says he's focusing for now on autonomous cargo operations because he feels that the path to regulatory approval for these will be smoother than for passenger carrying services. He also believes that this approach will overcome a shortage of qualified pilots in this sector of the air transport industry and also make operators three times more productive, potentially delivering cost savings of between 20 and 30%. So to prepare the way to launching autonomous freight airline operations, X-Wing recently started flying piloted services with a fleet of Grand Caravans based in Arizona. It's been contracted to provide cargo service by one of the largest express delivery groups in the US. And included in the flights that it's been operating so far have been operations to deliver coronavirus vaccines, protective equipment, and school supplies to locations such as the Navajo Nation Native American Reservation. Thanks for watching this AIN video. Please like, subscribe, and share it if you've enjoyed it. Also, visit AINonline.com for all the latest on the aviation industry.